Uh, I'm very happy to have this opportunity to talk to you. And, uh, in this lecture, uh, I would like to tell you about the uh, development of the study of CP violation and uh, flavor mixing, putting some emphasis on the contribution from Japan. This is the uh, plan of my talk. Uh, first, uh, I would like to uh, explain the present status of the uh, particle physics very briefly. Uh, this may help you locate our work uh, on the current understanding. Then uh, I would like to talk about the pioneering work of the Professor Shoichi Sakata and his group, uh, from which I learned uh, many things. Uh, then uh, I come to the uh, work on the CP violation co-authored with Dr. Toshihide Masukawa, and uh, I'll explain what we thought and uh, uh, what we found at that time. Then uh, I'll explain uh, about the subsequent development of the uh, uh, related uh, to our work. Experimental verification of the proposed model has been done uh, by using the accelerator called the B factories. So I will tell you about the outline of those experiments. Finally, I would glance over the uh, uh, flavor mixing in the lepton sector because this is a phenomenon uh, <coughs> parallel to the flavor mixing in the cork sector. And uh, Japan made a unique and important contribution uh, in this field. Uh, let me start by uh, reminding you the structure of the matter in the microscopic limit. Matter is made of atoms, and uh, uh, atoms consist of the uh, atomic nucleus and the electron. And the atomic nucleus is made of the proton and neutron, and the uh, proton and neutron uh, made of two kinds of the quarks you U and D. Present knowledge uh, on the elementary particles well described by the so-called standard model. According to the model, the number of the species of the coke is six. In addition to U and D, uh, we have uh, uh, C, uh, uh, C and T and B. Uh, similarly, the family of the electron consists of the six members. They are called the lepton. And the three types of neutrinos are among them. And another important ingredient of the uh, standard model is the fundamental interactions. Three kinds of interactions are acting on the quarks and the lepton. The strong interaction is described by QCD and the uh, uh, Electron magnetic and weak interaction by the Weinberg Salam gracious theory in a unified manner. All of them belong to the special type of the uh, field theory called the gauge theory. The standard model was established in 1970s. It was triggered by the uh, development of the gauge theory. In particular, the Gerald Tuhoff proved that the uh, generalized gauge theory is very normalizable. Uh, this opened the possibility that all the interactions of the elementary particle can be described as a quantum field theory without the difficulty of the divergence. Before this time, uh, before that time, uh, such description was uh, possible only for the electromagnetic interaction. Uh, another important progress made in 1970s was the discovery of the new flavor. Uh, among the six quarks and the six leptons, those uh, particles uh, on the right-hand side of this line uh, were found after 1970. In particular, the tau, uh, C, and B were found in 1970s. The quark model was proposed uh, by Marie German in, in 1964. At that time, the quark was U, D, and S. Our paper 
uh, was published in 1973, in which we proposed a six cork model to expand the CP violation. At that time, only three corks were widely accepted, and the slight hint of the fourth cork was there, but no one thought of the six corks. Before talking about uh, uh, some detail of our work, I would like to tell you about our background. Both Dr. Maskawa and I were graduated from Nagoya University and obtained a PhD also from Nagoya University. When I entered the graduate course, uh, theoretical particle physics group of the Nagoya University was known for unique research, uh, research activity led by Professor Shoichi Sakata. Uh, here, uh, I'd like to show you some achievement of the Sakata and his group. And uh, uh, in early 1950s, number of the uh, strange, par strange particles uh, were discovered. I, its first evidence was found in the cosmic ray uh, event in 1947. Uh, and the current terminology, the strange particle contained the s cork or uh, anti s cork as a constituent, while non-strange particles do not. Uh, but uh, uh, let me remind you that we are considering the year before the Coke model appeared. In uh, 1956, Sakata proposed a model which is known as the Sakata model, and just modeled all hadrons, uh, hadron means the strongly interacting particle, all hadrons strange and non strange are uh, supposed to be composite state of the fundamental triplet. Uh, P, N, and lambda. Okay. Uh, in other words, the uh, three variants, the P, N, and lambda, uh, the fundamental building block of the hadrons in this model. Uh, eventually, this model was uh, replaced by the Coke model, and where the triplet Cokes U, D, and S replaced uh, P, N, and lambda. But uh, we can say that the root of the uh, idea of the fundamental triplet is in the Sakata model. I'd like to discuss about the uh, in interesting development of the Sakata model. Uh, we focus on the weak interaction in the Sakata model. Usually, uh, usual beta decay is uh, of the atomic, uh, usual beta decay of the atomic nucleus is caused by the transition of the neutron into a uh, proton. Similarly, we can uh, consider the transition of the lambda particle into the proton. In the Sakata model, all the uh, weak interaction of the hadron can be described by these two kinds of the transition among the fundamental triplet. Uh, this uh, pattern of the uh, weak interaction is quite similar to the weak interaction of the lepton. At that time, the neutrino was thought as a single species. And the, uh, this similarity of the weak interaction was called the BL symmetry by the Gam Gamba, Marshak, and Okubo. Uh, in 1960, uh, Maki, Nakagawa, Onoki, and Sakata uh, developed the idea of the BL symmetry and proposed a so-called uh, Nagoya model. And this model, uh, they considered the uh, triplet variant uh, PN and lambda are respectively composite state of the uh, new E and mu and uh, hypothetical object called B matter, uh, denoted by B plus here. Uh, the composite picture of the Nagoya model uh, unfortunately, it did not make a remarkable progress, but the idea of the Nagoya model developed in an interesting way. In 1962, uh, it was discovered that uh, there exist two kinds of the neutrinos corresponding to each of the electron and the muon. When the uh, uh, result of this discovery at BNL uh, work to come out, two interesting papers were, were published. One is the Maki Nakagawa Sakata, and the other is the Katayama Matsumoto Tanaka Yamada. Uh, both papers discussed 
uh, modification of the Nagoya model to accommodate the two neutrinos in the model. Obviously, the number of the fundamental baryons becomes four, four corresponding to four leptons. The, in the course of the argument to associate the lepton baryons, Marketer precisely formulated the lepton flavor mixing. They discussed the masses of the neutrinos and derived this relation uh, described the uh, uh, mixing of the neutrino state. New, uh, where new one and new to the mass eigen state of neutrinos. Uh, there was, uh, today, uh, the lepton flavor mixing matrix is called MNS matrix. Of course, the MNS stands for the Maki Nakagawa and Sakata. Uh, lepton flavor mixing causes a phenomena called neutrino uh, oscillation. Many years later, neutrino oscillation was discovered in unexpected fashion. I'll come back to this point later. Another important outcome of this argument is the existence of the fourth fundamental particles. And this was discussed by Katayama et al. extensively. At this moment, the fundamental particles were still considered the baryons, but the uh, structure of the weak interaction is the same as that of the uh, glacial Iliopolis Mayani scheme. These uh, works revived in 1971 when New and his collaborator found a new kind of event in emergent chamber exposed to the cosmic ray. This is one of the events uh, they found. We can see kinks here and here, uh, which, which indicate the decay of the new particles produced in pair the estimated mass of the new particles was a 2 to 3 GB, and the life was a, a few times a 10 to the 14 seconds. When uh, this result was brought, Shuzo Ogawa, one of the followers of Sakata, immediately pointed out that this new particle might be related to the fourth uh, element expected in the extended version of the Nagoya model. At that moment, the Sakata model was already replaced by Koch model, so that uh, uh, what he meant was the, the, those new particles might be the charmed particle in the current terminology. Following this suggestion, the several Japanese group, including myself, uh, began to investigate the four Koch model. At that time, I was a graduate student of uh, Nagoya University. Okay, uh, so far I have explained about the uh, uh, unique activity of the Sakata and his group. I told about the four-cock model some detail, but I'm not trying to say that the six-cock model we proposed is a simple extension of the four-cock model. What I like to say is that the uh, atmosphere of the particle physics group of the Nagoya University was important for me. The most works I told here had been done by uh, Sakata and his group before I entered the graduate course. However, the spirit grown through these works was still there. I think I learned importance of the capturing the entire picture, which is necessary for this kind of work. And now uh, I like to proceed to our paper co-authored with uh, Dr. Maskawa. In 1971, renormalizability of non-Abelian gauge theory was proved. This enabled to describe the weak interaction with the quantum field theory in a consistent manner. And the uh, Weinberg sum glacial theory began to attract attention. In 1972, I obtained a PhD from Nagoya University and moved to Kyoto University. And then I uh, started this work. What we thought then was that the, if the gauge theory can describe the interaction of the particle consistently, CP violating interaction should also be included in it. Uh, CP violation was first found in 1964 uh, by Cronin Fitch et al. and the decay of the neutral chemism. The CP violation means the violation of uh, symmetry between the particle and antiparticle. 
the discovery of CP violation implies that uh, there is an essential difference between the particle and the antiparticle. Anyway, we investigated how to accommodate CP violation in the gaze theory. And what we found then was summarized here. Uh, at that time, uh, only uh, three quarks were widely accepted, as I said, but the uh, three quark model has some flaw in the gaze theory. Therefore, the, from the theoretical point of view, the four quark model was thought a uh, preferable one. However, we argued that uh, uh, it is impossible to accommodate the CP violation in the four quark model. This implies uh, there must be some unknown particle besides the fourth quark. I thought that uh, this is a quite a strong and important conclusion of our uh, uh, argument. Then uh, we considered a few possible mechanisms of CP violation by introducing new particles. We proposed the six coke model as one of such possible mechanisms. Here, uh, let me explain why four cokes are not enough and the six quarks are possible to accommodate the CP violation briefly. Uh, we consider the four quark case first. Uh, and the framework of the gauge theory, the flavor mixing arises from the mismatch between the gauge symmetry and the uh, particle state. Gauge symmetry lumps a certain number of the particle into a group called the multiplet. Uh, in this particular case, the multiplet uh, has the uh, two members. However, each uh, multiplet member is not necessarily identical to a single particle. Sometimes this is a superposition of particles. And the, uh, the flavor mixing is nothing but this superposition. In this uh, particular case, each of the uh, D prime and the S prime uh, it's a superposition to the real quark state D and S. Uh, it can be expressed in the matrix form here. And uh, this matrix uh, should be the, what is called the unitary matrix in the mathematics. The next problem is what the condition of the CP violation is. In the quantum field theory, uh, CP violation is related to the complex number coupling constant. Uh, to be more concrete in the present formulation, uh, CP violation will occur if irreducible complex numbers appear in those uh, mixing matrix element. Irreducible means the following. And the matrix element of the unitary matrix are complex number in general, but some of them can be made real a uh, real number by adjusting the phase factor of the particle field or particle state. In such case, those complex numbers are called reducible and otherwise irreducible. Therefore, the condition of the CP violation is that uh, there uh, remains complex numbers which cannot be removed by the phase adjustment of the particle field. In the Foucault model, uh, the adjustment factor is something like this. So uh, it's easy uh, to see that if we choose them properly, we can make any two by two unitary matrix into this form, which uh, has only the earlier element. So uh, in this case, we cannot accommodate the CP violation. How does this argument change in the six quark model? In the previous case, uh, we can express the flavor mixing in this way. However, uh, the, uh, uh, this time the mixing matrix is a three by three unitary matrix. In this case, we cannot remove all the phase factor of the matrix element by adjusting the phase of the coke field. After adjusting them as much as possible, we are left with this form of uh, our matrix expressed uh, with the four parameters. In this expression, uh, we have one parameter representing the imaginary part of the matrix element. 
therefore, the, if eta is not zero, uh, this system is violating CP symmetry. We saw that uh, this mechanism of CP violation is very interesting and smart, but we have no further reason to single out uh, six coke model from many possibilities. The model is not special because if the system is if the system is sufficiently many particles, it's not difficult to violate CP symmetry. However, the uh, subsequent experimental development pushed up the, this six coke model to a special position. In uh, 1974, uh, JPSI particle was discovered, and, and soon it turned out that it uh, bound state of the four coke C and and uh, its anti-particle. The discovery uh, had great impact on the particle physics, but it had little effect on the six coke model. In uh, 1975, the tau lepton was discovered. The, this discovery had a significant effect in our, on our model. The tau is the fifth lepton, although it's a lepton, uh, it is suggesting the existence of the third family in the coke sector too. So people began to pay attention to our model. Early works which discussed the six coke model include the Pakubasa Sugawara and the Erisgayar nanopores. In uh, 1977, the Eupersum particle was discovered and it turned out uh, that it's a bound state of the fifth coke B and anti-B. Uh, the discovery of the last coke T was as late as 1995, but uh, uh, before that time, the six coke model became the standard one. Meanwhile, it was pointed out that we can expect large CP violation or large CP asymmetry in the B meson system by uh, uh, these uh, people. Uh, this opened the possibility to test the model with the B factories. B meson implied the uh, bosonic particle uh, cons containing a B or anti B coke as a constituent, and the B factory means that the accelerator which produces a B meson uh, like a factory. To test the uh, model, uh, two B factories were built one at KK in Japan and one uh, at SRAC in the US. KKB is the name of the accelerator, and the uh, Bell is the name of the experimental group. Similarly, PEP2 is the accelerator, but Bar is the experimental group. And uh, this slide and the uh, uh, next two are provided by those experimental groups. Those accelerators are unusual one. Colliding er electron and the positron have different energies. So, so that they, uh, they produce particles are boosted. They were approved and started the experiment almost at the same time. And in the PEP2 Barbara ceased operation this year, while the KKB bell is still running. The uh, luminosity of the 10 to the 34th, they achieved uh, at the record high. The luminosity is a key parameter representing the high uh, performance of the colliding accelerator. This uh, is a slide of the PEP2 uh, Baba, and the, uh, this one is KB Bell, and both of them are large international cooperation. Uh, skipping all the detail of the experiment, let me show you the uh, result. The uh, colored circle and the cones uh, showing the experimental constraint on the mixing parameter uh, law and eta, which appeared in the previous slide. The order constraint overlap around here, this narrow region. So uh, uh, this means that the uh, six coke model can explain all those results by choosing the parameter in, in, in this in this region. Okay. Uh, in the uh, light of the V factor result, that the present status of the CP violation can be uh, summarized as false. 
uh, B factory results uh, show that the quark mixing the six quark model is the uh, dominant source of the CP violation. The uh, B factory result, however, allowed a small room for the uh, additional source from new physics beyond the standard model. The matter dominance of the universe seems requiring new uh, source of the CP violation because uh, it appears that the CP violation of the six quark model is too small to explain the matter dominance of the universe. Uh, some people are thinking that the last point uh, may be uh, related to the lepton flavor mixing, uh, which is a counterpart of the quark mixing. Uh, in regard to the lepton flavor mixing, Japanese group has been making a very important contribution. So I like to touch upon this using the last few minutes. And the most important achievement is the discovery of the neutrino oscillation at Super Kamiokande. Uh, Super Kamiokande is a huge uh, water tank detector uh, located in the Kamioka mine in the central part of Japan, Japan. This great discovery was led by Yoji Totsuka and to our uh, deep regret, Yoji Totsuka passed away in the last July. They were observing neutrinos produced by the cosmic ray in the atmosphere surrounding the Earth. Since the neutrino penetrate the Earth, those neutrinos come to uh, the detector also from the bottom. The neutrino oscillation implies that the species of the neutrino changes during its flight. So if the neutrino oscillation takes place while the neutrinos are traveling the distance from the other side of the Earth, observed number of the uh, particular kind of neutrino will be reduced. And the, this is the result of uh, the observation. The red bar uh, uh, expectation for the non-oscillation case and the crosses are uh, real data. This result show a clear deficit and it's completely consistent with the neutrino oscillation. The uh, neutrino oscillation uh, was further confirmed by two experiments using the man-made uh, neutrinos. One uh, is a K2K experiment. And this experiment, uh, neutrinos were produced by the proton synchrotron in KK laboratory and observed by Super Kamiokande. Uh, this is a neutrino spectrum uh, observed at the Super Kamiokande, and the data show a clear oscillation pattern. Uh, since the uh, produced neutrino is mostly mu type one, uh, this type of the experiment is called the new, new mu uh, disappearance experiment. The other experiment is a Kamran experiment. Kamran detector is using the uh, liquid disintegrator instead of the water, and it's located also in the Kamioka mine. The, uh, they observed the neutrino produced in the nuclear reactor in the surrounding area. And the uh, data shows the clean agreement with the oscillation. So far, uh, we uh, have seen the past experiment. The, however, this one, T2K, is an upcoming experiment. The neutrinos will be produced by the newly built accelerator J Park located in Tokai, uh, 60 kilometers northeast of KK, and sent to uh, beam is sent to Super Kamiokan. The distance is more or less the same uh, as the K two K experiment, but intensity will be much higher. T two K experiment. Uh, aims new E appearance measurement, which means the new mu to new E oscillation. And uh, this measurement has a crucial importance for estimating the possible size of the CP violation in the lepton sector, which may have some implication for the matter dominance of the universe. Uh, okay, uh, in summary, uh, I think uh, that uh, Japan made important contribution to the flavor physics. 
It includes uh, early activities of the Sakata group on both uh, hadron and lepton flavors, and the experimental studies of the B meson system at KK B factory, and neutrino oscillation at Super Kamiokande and Kamran. I'm very glad that uh, I was able to be an eyewitness of many of uh, these developments. In particular, uh, I could work together with a colleague of the V Factory experiment. And above all things, I am very happy that I could make a contribution through the work with uh, Dr. Maskawa to this development. Thank you very much for your attention. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for your interesting lecture and for leading us through the development of, of uh, elementary particle physics over the last uh, 30 or 40 years. Thank you Thank very you much. Very